un criminel. Did you bring a canoe? Or do you expect your gentle breeding to keep you from the alligators? Best take one of mine then. And learn to use it right quick. Smugglers. Such an ugly word. Even slavers are called merchants. Why can my title be... Queen of the Bog? Protector of innocence, paddling instructor, and champion of trade. Too long to fit on a wanted poster. Tell me, when did your troubles with Macanda's men begin? About the same time the Spanish governor arrived. Just a big old coincidence, I'm sure. This is as far as the water will take us.
They set up their base around a wrecked ship that ran aground not far from here. The other base is a little further along. There. I'll check out this base. You scout ahead. Oui, oui, mon capitaine. Ah! Whoa! Glad I didn't put money on that fight. <laughs> Would have lost. And barely a scratch on you. Now here's a pretty prize. An alligator egg. Take it. You've earned it. Aveline! A woman among reptiles. Takes one to know one. Oui, that it does. Right then. If you don't run the bastard through right here, I'll meet you at the next base.
my faithful acolyte. The day of the sacred ceremony draws near. I am in want of nothing but more men to join our ranks. Gather the faithful and await my word. Still in one piece, I see. What did you find? A letter from the coward Macandal. He's preparing a ceremony. Voodoo? Yes, but to what end? Power. What other end is there? Show him you've got the spirits at your back. Especially the mean ones. And people do most anything you say. There's your real magic. It's that way, well hidden in the trees. Wait, I recognize those men. They're escaped slaves, hired from Saint Danger. The Shanty Town? Oui, though it barely deserves the name. A cramped, miserable place. The men I saw at your camp, they were from Saint Danger? Oui, <laughs> Roussillon wasn't too happy when I hired them, but he got used to the idea. Please, you can't hurt them. It goes without saying. Best of luck, then. Go. I'll be at the office if you need me.
My faithful acolyte, preparations are complete. Our ceremony will take place on the eve of St. John. Assemble my followers. Balls of steel. Et puis? Where is Elise? My company doesn't satisfy you? Oh, I am hurt. <sighs> Pray, tell me what you found. I'm as good a confidant as the uh, lady, I swear. It's not a confidant I need, but an informant. Macandal is holding a ceremony on St. John's Eve tonight, but I don't know where. I know who can help, and you can help me in return. Uh, there's a... Uh, oh, 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 a witch doctor in saint -Anger. The eyes and ears of the bayou. I sent Elise to him with supplies, but she forgot this. <laughs> so hard to find honest criminal help these days. <laughs> Give him this. With his trust, the secrets of the bayou will be yours. Thank you. By the by, come back when you are done. I have a job or two that could use a woman of your caliber. And some work as well. Huh. 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 
Aveline, does Macandal still live? He's holding a ceremony tonight. Venerable one, I bring supplies from Roussillon. Mm, thank you. This Macandal is a dark influence over the people of Sandanji. If you can stop him, I will help. His shadow emanates from the shore of Lake Pontchartrain. He has a poison in his possession, from which you will not recover if stung. I will give you the antidote, but it will not stop the poison, only limit its damage. Time is short. You must take this now. I've had words, I think. Thank you. We'll strike tonight. I'll disguise myself as a slave, so that I'm invisible to Macondal's followers. I'll be ready when you are. St. John won't know what hit him. Working with Roussillon. Years. Is he your. Well. Oh, oh, God, no. No, no. Don't get me wrong. I pluck my eye out for him. But I wouldn't bet the lech if he were the last man in Nouvelle France. How do you know him? To. S <clears throat> Roussillon saved my life once, long ago. I figured I owed him, so I helped him expand his business. The old devil showed me a few tricks, too. Taught me his trade, if you will. Of course, I do all the work. Well, here it is. The realm of the dead. Homey, ain't it? I was trained by... I know only too well who your master was, Baptiste. Just remember where your loyalties lie. I shall not fail you. See that you don't. My faithful acolytes, stand ready. The time of our ritual is now. Ugh. 
Approach from the far side and create a distraction. Wait for it before you move. Oui, oui, mon capitaine. One of the finest I ever made. I remember the day that coward Agate stole it. Fitting he should remain too spineless to face me. But I have captured his pawn. Now he will be forced from hiding. How do you know Agate? So he is here as I suspected. Agate was my disciple once. If not for that thieving woman. Who are you really? The true Macandal burned at the stake. I see. You know your history. Very well. Nosua Macondal was my mentor. And an assassin. But he failed. She betrayed us and he died. I won't make that mistake before I carry out his life's destiny. The poison fails. <gasps> Myself. The ceremony will go on. You cannot stop it. When I am done with you, I will destroy your mentor. By your hand, 
Agate betrays me one final time. Look at you where I know it well. The first time Agate betrayed me, it was for the woman, the thief. She wore one just like it. Who was she? What was her name? What was her name? Here is something they did not want you to know. A missing piece of the puzzle. Here is my special Erudito cut. The nobles of New Orleans shall perish by poison, and the slaves shall be avenged. My mentor's work will be complete. And control of the river will fall to those who know what to do with it. Then I will be inducted into the Templar Order. As agreed, if you make good on your word. Fear not, senor. I was trained by... I know only too well who your master was, Baptiste. Just remember where your loyalties lie. I shall not fail you. See that you don't. My faithful acolytes, stand ready. The time of our ritual is now.
Agate, I have done as you asked. The imposter is dead. He was working with De Ferrer. Hmm. What else have you learned? Only... that he would have forced you out of hiding. Let us be thankful it did not come to that. If it had our brotherhood... Well, let us not dwell. You have destroyed the hornet's nest in the bayou. At least for now. De Ferrer will have his day.
Señorita. Bonsoir. I'm a friend of Captain Dominguez. Is he on board? <laughs> at this hour, El Capitan is at the tavern. Where else? Thank you. Farewell and adieu to your Paris, Paris letters. Farewell and adieu to your letters of Spain. Spain is the only thing I am. I am Carlos Capitan. Dominguez. We meet again. Do we? All three of you look familiar. <laughs> but you're all welcome back to my cabin. I've manhood for... I don't think... Or we can consort right here! <laughs> what do you know about Rafael Joaquin de Ferrer? I'm afraid he's not invited. <laughs> What's your business with him? He pays for transport to and from New Orleans. That's all I do. Transport the things and get paid. Things, paid. Transport, paid. Back and forth and forth and back. What is he doing? Why New Orleans? <laughs> I do not know. Senor de Ferrer is a very secretive man. <laughs> Thank you for your time, Capitan. <laughs> Aveline, out and about as always. But home to rest now, Papa. Monsieur Blanc tells me you do a great service to my business. To our business? For it will be your husband someday. Oh, Papa, you know I should sooner mind my own business than marry. As stubborn as your mother, Jeanne. If only she could see you now. But she can't. No. But perhaps you are old enough now. It is not much. One page. But it is from her diary. You should have it. Mama. Thank you, Papa.
Papa, he surprised me. I dared not interrupt. Your music is breathtaking. I dare say you could stop a man's heart. You flatter me too much, Papa. The credit belongs to my teacher. I am but an instrument of his will. How blessed we are with a daughter who uses her talents in peace, not to riot in the streets of New Orleans. There is so much unrest since the arrival of the Spanish. Well, I don't want to keep you from your practice. I simply came with a message from Monsieur Blanc. At your leisure, he requests your assistance at the warehouse. Do take care when you go. The streets are not safe for a lady. No need to worry, Papa. I will try to restrain myself. I know your charm and grace will protect you like armor. Torturers! Kidnappers! We demand answers! Unwashed scabs! Go back to your swamps! How many more will disappear? Get back, or I'll give you a reason to protest! The man is down. Don't abuse what little power you have. All right, let me go. Now, what's this all about? People have been turning up missing. Or not turning up, rather. That's why we... But you have proof the Spanish are behind it? Kidnappings have increased since they got here. Increased? Life was never easy. Now, it's worse. Rioting will only worsen your plight. You need evidence. And how are we going to get that? I... I don't know... yet. Some help you are. Bien bonjour! Bonjour, très cher. Aveline, good day. I have a, a surprise for you. What do you think? To the unknowing eye, an unassuming warehouse. But to our brotherhood, your new headquarters. Agate takes his office in the swamp. But we thought you might prefer this for your business dealings. From this desk you can manage, or better still, expand your family's trading empire.
This room is all yours. And all of your guises are kept here. Over here, you have a private place to change your guise. And most importantly, your weapons and tools will be kept here. <sighs> it is to your liking, then. It's perfect. In that case, I will leave you a quiet moment to familiarize yourself with everything. Evelyn, I've, um, concocted a special instrument for you. A uh, parasol? I suppose I should thank you, but... Uh, allow me to, uh, demonstrate. See? Elegant and deadly. Just like my lady. Monsieur Blanc, you do know me so well. Ah! Right. Um, so... Business. Do you recall our rival, Monsieur Boucher, who was twice caught watering his wine? Up to his old tricks again? Now he claims our coffee. He rods the nerves. He has erected a stall in the market by the docks and distributes handbills to that effect. Sales are impacted, and we have enough trouble keeping money in the company as it is. Say no more. I'll see to it that he ceases his slander. <laughs> 